Okay, so after our uh, trek to Mount Everest base camp, we finish up in Lukla and we stay at the Yeti Mountain home. It's a beautiful tea house property that's in Lukla, right near the landing strip. We have a final dinner there. Say goodbye to our local Sherpa team, and the next morning we head over to Lukla Airport. Quite early, we fly back to Kathmandu from Lukla, about 35 minutes on a Twin Otter plane. We leave the Lukla airport, land in Kathmandu. It's usually quite early. When we get into Kathmandu, we come to the Hyatt here in Kathmandu. It's closer to the airport. And this is where we stay after our Everspace camp track. The Hyatt is a beautiful property. And they have been so gracious in letting us get early check-ins when the rooms are available. This time I had 20 people on the Everspace camp track. We came to the Hyatt and every single person was in their room before 10.30 in the morning. By 8.55, guests were starting to be able to go to their room. So that's really nice. And if they're available, they've been so good to us and let us stay. So um, right here's the, the main entrance doors to the Hyatt. And uh, there's always a team of guys waiting here. What we do is when we leave the Yak and Yeti, we um, have bags that we check in there. And um, then our local team in Kathmandu goes and gets those bags, transports them over, so when we arrive, all the bags are waiting here for the guests, okay? They usually get an early check-in. If it's available, we never promise that, but um, they've been good to us. Then during the day, we're gonna go into Tamel. Um, there's a couple options. Guests can go into Tamel, have a shave and a haircut, which is quite popular with the men, go out to lunch and do some shopping for all of the fun stuff that you can buy here in Nepal. We also make spa appointments and a number of the people on the trip stay behind here at the Hyatt and enjoy the spa. Midday, the group is basically on their own um, for their lunch and we do that because everything is so scheduled during our trip. Once we get in here, uh, some people want to go to the spa, some people just want to relax in their room, some people want to go shopping. We're also very close to Bodhana, uh, the largest stupa in Nepal that's just right behind the Hyatt so people want to go over there and check that out so everybody's pretty much roaming around we'll do lunch on their own um, we will have a van go to Tamel and then and we'll set a turnaround time so the van will leave Tamel and come back here to the Hyatt otherwise people just take a simple taxi cab yeah then we're back here at the Hyatt and we have a celebration uh, private dinner beautiful dinner right on the edge of the pool in the back of the Hyatt and um, our guests and our local team and some special guests are always invited to the celebration dinner where we have our awards and some other fun stuff uh, that's always a surprise for our guests. So yeah, we have a great night following day. Um, we had some guests head on to an extension into Bhutan. So they went to Bhutan the next day um, and then guests start shuttling to the airport at their designated departure time so hi it's a beautiful property i'm going to show you through right now and um yeah let's take a walk through the hyatt 